All right, fellas. Uh, <clears throat> welcome. Welcome to some Dragon Age. The Veil Guard. Um, so we already created our character. Um, pronouns were he, him. And uh, there's no she, her, they, them around here. Okay? There's none of that here. Let's see how this game is. I already played through the beginning of it, guys. And uh, like the opening of it. So let's start exploring uh, what's going on here. I chose a warrior class. Uh, let's see what we got. It says we got to explore. As of now, I like the environments. Graphics doesn't look bad, but it could look a bit better. But I don't think this was made on our this wasn't made on our real engine 5, so that's why it's not looking as good. Um, I heard a few stories of a few things going on in this game with some dialogue. So you guys are gonna hear my reaction through that. Let's see what we got here. Look who's with us. We're, uh, we're really in the fade. Land of raw magic, nightmares, and this, apparently. It's a lot to take in. Harding thought we should talk about what comes next. She's not wrong. But if you need a breather, can't hurt to look around first. Level two. All right. Let's level up. So I'll acquire that. I gotta acquire this. Circle, circle, then square triangle. Oh, okay. So that. Hmm. So you got skills, library. Pretty simple. Uh. I still have two points. So survival. Let's go to survival. Oh, that is the okay. <clears throat> R2, then triangle on return. Rage takes you to some longer to begin to decay. It's pretty good. While airborne. Nice. Counter blow, although after a parry, that's not bad. Hmm. How many points does this take? Doesn't say. Oh, everything is one point. I guess I can only. Oh, you have to go this way. Hmm. Interesting. Let's do, let's, oh, what is that? Oh, a special ability. Oh. On your guard, protect yourself from enemies, foolish around to attack. Very high stagger. Oh, that's pretty good. All right. Now we're talking. Now we are talking. <coughs> Oh, what is that? Wisps. Figures are in the fate, but I swear they're following me. You are right. Strange place you've fallen into, but I'll work with it. You know me. Uh, do I? I know Varric wanted you for the job. You know the same about me. It's a start. Ah. 
I'm not sure stopping a ritual is the best way to meet someone. So much for first impressions. Here's hoping I'm better on the second. Well, you're not bad so far. You take a lot of notes. What about? Lately, what we know, or knew, before Solus changed the game. And it's... Not much. I'm sure Lace would hate to hear that, but one step at a time. We'll figure this out. I'm sure of it. Really? Do you know something I don't? No, we just... well... well, we have to, right? <laughs> yeah, that's the job. All right, uh, let's see. Explore the right, oh, talk to Harding. Well, where's that at? <coughs> so. We stopped the ritual. And Varric paid the price. Hey. Varric made his choice to go talk with Solus. He knew the risks. We all did. And now Solus is gone. And we're here. Wherever here is. Besides in the Fade. Solus called it the Lighthouse. He did? When? Huh. He invaded my dream. While I was out cold, he showed up in my dream, and he's really mad that we stopped his ritual. Good. He's also trapped in some kind of prison in the Fade. Not happy about that, either. You're sure that wasn't just a dream? It's a reasonable reaction. Solus can speak with people in their dreams. Even kill them. I'm safe on that front. I bled a little when I got knocked out. Enough that he can gripe at me, but not enough that he can make my head explode. So Solus is using blood magic, like any normal mage would to play with your mind. But he's not a normal mage, like I told you. He's an elven god. Putting together a nice ritual doesn't make him a god. Hmm. We all know he's not a god, but it's faster than saying ancient elven mage every time we talk about him. All right, well, we've stopped the ritual, and there doesn't seem to be an immediate danger. For now. You're certain Solus can't use blood magic to affect your mind? I'm not certain of anything. But we're not out of danger. What do you mean? Solus had two of the other elven gods imprisoned. When he got trapped, they escaped. So those things we saw come out of the Fade when the ritual went wild, those are... Elganarn and Gilanane. Two of the ancient elven gods that Solus rebelled against. <sighs> They're ours to kill. They're our next target. So we set our sights on a pair of elven gods. Like it's easy. Who else is gonna do it? If they're loose, they need killing. They were evil tyrants who enslaved their people. We need to stop them. Solus says Elganarn and Gilanane drew on the Blight for power and became corrupted. That was when he imprisoned them. So instead of one... God running around, we have two. And they're not just powerful, they're blighted. We need to get out there and stop them. Just like that. Without Varric. And you're still getting back on your feet. I'm fine. We can't just sit here and do nothing. We need to investigate. Figure out what we're dealing with before we rush in and make things worse. And how many more people will get hurt, get killed, while we spend time investigating? Hmm. Oh, uh, fuck. Uh, no, we gotta investigate. Calm down. If Elganarn and Gilanane are worse than Solus, we can't go in blind. We need to know what they can do and what they want. But we only have Solus's word about all of this. Let's go investigate for ourselves. We find out what we're dealing with, and then we take our shot. Fine. The Alluvian led us here instead of back to Minrathis. Let's hope it goes back to the ritual site. 
Maybe we can find some clues at the scene of the crime. Harding, you okay to go? I'm not gonna sit back while elven gods destroy the world because I have a headache. All right then. Let's get back to the ritual site. The Alluvian has its own special room. It's just down the stairs. All right, let's see. Uh, find the Alluvian. It says talk to Harding, but where is he? Or is she at this point? Can't tell anymore. Oh wait, is it down there? Oh, it is down here. What is that? Oh. Huh. For all we know, there's a dozen demons waiting on the other side of that alluvian. If it even takes us back to Arlefin. <sighs> Hardik, you sure you're up for this? I'm fine. I gotta say, the character models are not that bad looking. Well then. Shall we? Let's do this. Quiet. Well, isn't that a surprise? There's the ritual site. But if the gods really did get out, they're not here anymore. Right, let's take a look around and see if we can find... Oh, crap. Strife? Irlin? It's me, Lise Harding. Harding? What are you doing back in Arlathan? It's complicated. I can see that. Rook, Nev, this is Strife and Irlin. Varric and I met them when we first started hunting down Solas. They're veil jumpers, experts in ancient elven magic. Hardly experts. I should have been able to shut that artifact down. I'm sorry, Tarith. It's not your fault. Since the sky ripped open, the magic's been surging. Bunch of artifacts that had been dormant for centuries started coming alive. This is because of Finn Harrell's... Sorry. Solus's ritual, isn't it? You all were supposed to stop him. Hey, man. We tried. We found Solus and stopped his ritual, but things took a turn. The magic went wild. Solus was dragged into the Fade, into some kind of prison. But when he went in, something or someone else got out. Elganon and Gilanane, supposedly. Athalanast. The return of our gods, the Evanuris. If those two are back out in the world, it explains a lot. Like what? Artifacts that have been dormant for centuries are awakening. Something that would need a source of tremendous magical energy. Like two of our old gods. 
So the gods are real. I was really hoping that the Dreadwolf was lying to us about all of this. He's the god of lies. But some things are sacrosanct, even to him. He might be a bastard, but he's a damn sight better than the Evanuris. There's a reason Solus led the rebellion against the Evanuris, and a reason he imprisoned them. But now they've escaped. Tarith is in bad shape. We need to get him back to the camp. We've still got dozens of Veil Jumpers unaccounted for. How can we help? We need to find Bellara Lute. She's the best there is at working with our ancient artifacts. And also at blowing them up. She was off looking for another artifact before this ritual shook everything loose. If anyone can get a handle on all this wild magic and the artifacts it's setting off, it'll be her. Right. Then you two get your friend back to your camp and we'll... <laughs> we'll find Ballara. No, Harding is, uh... Harding, you're injured. Stay here with the Veil Jumpers. I can help. I know you want to, but we don't know what we'll face out there, and you're in no condition to fight. Okay, fine. I'll stay. We'll meet you back at the Veil Jumper camp. It's just south of here. Bellara's out near some elven ruins to the west. At least she was three days ago. I'd start your search there. Good luck, Rook. And thank you. Is it me? All right. There's something strange about this fog. I've never <clears throat> seen fog like this. Something's not right. Oh, actually, the game looks pretty good. So that suit of armor is moving. I gotta get used to that. Oh, oh. Badass. Oh, people. <laughs> what? Where'd you come from? Bellara? Bellara Luter. Strife and Irulin sent us to find you. Who are you, exactly? Call me Rook. Nev Gallus. Wait, I know that name. But protocol is to wait a full week before they send anyone out to look for me? I've only been gone three days. Well, the situation's changed. For the worse, unfortunately. The elven gods Elganarn and Gilanane have escaped from Fen'Harel's prison. And it seems like they want to destroy the world. Oh. Yes, that is very much for the worse. Okay, wait. I need a second. Uh... You don't have it. Oh. It's a lot to take in. It does sort of explain a few things, though. Like what exactly? The surge of raw magic in the area. These artifacts started waking up a while ago, but in fits and starts. One here, a couple there. Then, a couple of days ago, the sky split open. And now, raw magic. Thick as fog. Only a god, or gods, could have done that. There's something kind of exciting about it. And dangerous. Really dangerous. Dangerous enough that I was gonna head back to the Veil Jumper camp, but... But what? See that shimmer? That's a Veil Bubble. It's separating us from the rest of the real world, so to speak. You can only pass through it one way. Once you're in, you can't get out. We don't have time for this. Let's just force our way out. Oh, I wouldn't do that. I don't know what contacting that much raw magic would do to you. But there's another way. A bubble like that? There has to be something at the center that's generating it. Something powerful. 
we can find it and remove it safely. I mean, the bubble itself should collapse. And then we're back in reality? I sure hope so. Well then, let's get going. All right. Woo. Wait. Where did I come from? <clears throat> What's over here? Odd to find a camp this far out. We've got camps all over Arlathan. The bail jumpers do, I mean. Never really know when or where the magic's gonna start going wild. Ooh, that's badass. Uh huh. Oh, I can tell him to do the special moves. Oh, come on. I gotta get used to this gameplay here. I like the environments. Looking nice. And the water is not bad. Trying to get to the artifact at the center of the bubble, but these magical constructs keep getting in the way. A few dozen demons shouldn't be a problem. Spirits, not demons. They're animating those suits of armor. The armor's attuned to the artifact to protect it from threats. Ah, and hey. I'm guessing it sees us as threats. Nice. A little exploring going on. A little exploration. What's over there? Nothing. Bro, did that rabbit just... Oh, come on. What is happening? Is that water just swirling into the air? We call that kind the whirlpool. The anomaly, I mean. Never seen one this size, though. <clears throat> Let's see. Why do they disappear? What's going on? I have to go up there. But just how do I get up there? How do I get up there? Oh, through there. Come on. Uh -huh. Demons! Right where we need to go. Well, let's deal with this. So I like a companion. Oh, now they're teaching me how to do that, huh? Oh, crap. That's pretty cool. Any ideas on what the artifact we're looking for might be? I have a couple of theories, but nothing definite. We might find some clues in the ruins, though. Aha. Uh -huh. Usually see elven ruins that haven't been picked over. Not many people come this far into Arlathan. 
Just veil jumpers mostly. And people trying to save the world, apparently. Nice. Well, isn't this a sight? Wait, is this? No. See, this is what I like. I like environments like that. This is my type of game. Can't be what? We have to get over there. The artifact we're looking for must be inside. Do you know what this place was? Could have been a temple, could have been where they stored food. But judging by the sentinels, it's probably something important. Wait, what we just New area, oh never mind then. Looks similar to the area we were. No way across. Think we can make the jump? Oh, no, we can make a bridge. There should be a power crystal somewhere nearby. This this it? There you go. Got it. Bring it over here and slot it in. And there we go. Easy. Nice. Wow. Isn't that something? A resonance amplifier. It's drawing magic from the ring temple to this area. I need to shut it down before we can go up the path. But doing that will attract anything nasty that's hanging around. We're ready. Do it. Do it. I really forget how to block sometimes. Ah! Oh, come on. That goes to you. Ah. Not too bad. Oh, I still got him. Oh, come on. Oh, they had a shield. And then their health. Nice. The last of the magic energy. Pat should be clear ahead. Nice. Oh, I show. Aha. She looks over here. Oh, it's just like top of it. What is that? That's a chest. So you're really Nev Gallus, the detective from Minrathis? Last time I checked, I've read about you. You've gone after some powerful mages before, but Ben Harrell? The real Ben Harrell? And now Elganon and Gilanane, apparently. My actual gods are out there trying to end the world, and Nev Gallus is on the case. I just. I can't believe it. Oh my god! <clears throat> I can't believe it. Oh shit. We'll have to take it down. Nice. Easy enough. 
But watch out. Whenever you see one, there's more nearby. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, let's continue the temple. Seeing these kinds of things never gets old. Anything here that can help you piece together what exactly that artifact is? I have a theory, but we're miles away from where that artifact should be. Oh, but now I can go through there. Oh, it's the same thing. That's badass. Ooh. I got a better axe. Yeah, I got a better axe. Nice. Badass. There's like three of those? Oh, I gotta use the axe for that one. Oh. Yep. Yep. Nice. Oh, crap. Boom. That's what's up. Is this another chest? Oh, I already picked up that chest. Okay, environments are fun. Environments are nice. Gameplay is... No, it's fun. So far. It looks nice. Graphically, it looks pretty decent. Bound to a crystal. Ancient elves use them to store knowledge and to help them dream. What in the world is that? What in the world is that? Mythalinast. Dark spawn. Dark spawn. Oh, they go by quick though. Oh shit. Oh, crap. Dark spawn. Here. That was I crazy. Would have it. Until today. What's over here? Nice. Resonance amplifiers. Ah. Get ready. 
Once I shut it down, the path Let's do it. will remain blocked until the magic dissipates. Let's do it. I'll draw you back. I'm on it. Oh, it's the dark spawn now, huh? Come at me, suckers. Come on. Come on. What you got? Out of here. Get clear. 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 I've never seen Dark Spawn this deep into Arlington Forest before. As far as I know, it's never happened. The Elven Gods be commanding the Dark Spawn. Solus did say they were blighted. Clear. You saw those Dark Spawn though? Something what is down here? About them. Oh, I already went here. Them. Once we get out of this bubble. Right. Let's get to that central temple. What's over here? Ah. Ooh. Aha. Where are they coming from? Whoa, whoa, where are they? Where's that coming from? Nice, nice, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Huh, gold material. I still got a what crafting and all that, I'm guessing. Another resonance amplifier. Should be the last one, I hope. Fingers crossed. Can't go that way. Oh, there's that guy, huh? Nice. Damn, they're really annoying. Crap. Oh, come on. What? Oh, my goodness. We're close. I 
can feel it. Have you noticed something about the blight? Where it is, I mean? It's almost like it's feeding off the elven magic. Is that? Oh, look at that. Look at that. Huh. Very nice. what I think it is, then the alignment means we're here. This is it. This is where it was kept. Where what was kept? The Archive Spirit, or as the ancient elves called it, Nodis Durthalin. It mm. means the inevitability of knowledge. Why is it called that? Oh, is that a boss fight? I don't know, actually. The notes were never very clear on that, but I plan to find out. Oh, con my, my, my. Oh, he blocked that? Oh, crap. <laughs> I just knocked them out. <laughs> I just knocked him out. Looks like the store is going to need a second power crystal. Then let's go find it. What is that? Better shield. Nice. Got myself a better shield. What is that? I gotta put something in there. My, my, my. Aha. We'll check this out. Huh? Oh, what? Another ballista. I bet we oh. could use it to break through that wall. Break through. Oh. Break through what wall? Oh. 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 Get him. Get him. Nice. Oh, look at that. There we go. My, my, my. Boom. Oh, I gotta have two of them. Power to do. 
Power to do. We did it. All that's left is the Nautis Drithalin. I have so many questions for it. You're going to ask it questions? It's an archive spirit. You'll see. Uh oh. I better ask? Yo! I'm liking this. See? A better ax. Thalen. So we take it and we're good, right? We can head back. Oh, I wish. No, it, it, it's a lot trickier than that. As if darkspawn demons and animated suits of armor aren't tricky enough. Hmm. What do you mean by tricky exactly? If I remove the artifact the way I'd usually do it, it'll explode and take out half of Arlathan with it. Good news is, I think I can shunt the energy somewhere else. Okay, here we go. The way the magic is pulsing, I've never seen this before. It's almost like it's breathing Oh snap Ogre That's an ogre Yeah, I can see that Boss fight Whoa! Big swings. Yo, this axe. Oh, crap. Yo, come on. Ah, crap, I knew it was gonna hit me. Boya! Oh ho 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 ho! Oh ho! I was badass. Okay, okay, that was good. Well, wasn't expecting to fight an ogre today. Then again, I also didn't expect to learn that my gods are rampaging around and trying to end the world. Just one of those days. Okay. Let's see. Okay, okay. There we go. No, no, no. That's good. I think. Oh. What 
does that crystal do? Keeps the artifact powered. Focuses the ambient magical energy. That's why these things still work, thousands of years later. Oh. No, you don't. Sulanan, Vir Sulevanan, and Asal Dirthara. Well then, I am the Nadas Dirthara. Right, um, I have questions. I am the Nadas Dirthara. What do you? So that's the Nardis to Thala. It was, or is, I mean. Crystal's broken, though. Needs fixing. It's kind of my thing, fixing magical stuff. Strife and Irulan will want to know about this. And the Blight, and the Darkspawn. Let me know when you're ready to head to the Bail Jumper camp. Hmm. Well, first I got a loot. Potions full. What is that uncommon? Lombo. Oh, for Bellara. Do it. Nice. I got full health. All right, let's go. Oh, wait. Oh, that was a potion. Ready to go? Let's go. Right. Let's get moving. Come on, I'll show you the way to the Bail Jumper camp. Oh, come on, loading screens. Come on, it's 2024. Experienced fighters are still missing. We're running out of bail jumpers. Whatever's going on out there, it's scary. Jahel and Milva never reported back from Demeter's crossing. There are a hundred people living in that village, or near enough. You're back, and you're alive. Good. Sounds like things have gotten a lot worse since we left. Darkspawn. They're showing up all over Arlathan, attacking anyone in their path. We've evacuated three daily settlements already. We ran into Darkspawn, too, near the Nadis Durthalan. Wait, you found the Nadis Durthalan? The Archive Spirit? We could ask it about the gods, figure out their next move. Hmm. If it weren't broken, maybe. But we're not getting anything out of it anytime soon. Meanwhile, bell jumpers are disappearing. Something out there took them. I know. But maybe, if we find them... We find the gods, or at least some sign of where they might be. But Arlathan Forest is huge. Where do we even begin to look for them? Demeta's Crossing. What? Irulan and Strife, when we came in, you said you'd lost contact with Demeta's Crossing. We could go check it out. 
The three of us, I mean. You mean four? You're not leaving me behind. You were just wounded. We can... You'll have to tie me up to keep me here. I don't know what you're going to find there, Rook. Likely nothing good. But you'd be saving people. And it might get you on the trail of the gods. Demeta's crossing's on the far side of the lake. There's a small boat at the docks. It'll take you there. Watch your back out there. And good luck. All right. Could we really be at war with okay. All right, fellas. To get there. Let's head to the dock. So there'll be some gameplay for uh, some Dragon Age Velgar. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will see you guys on the next video. Let's see. I've heard a bunch of things about this game so far. It's only I've only played it for a couple hours. First hour of the opening, second hour right here. And uh, I think it's, as, of, as of now, the game is cool. It's fun. Um, not too crazy about the dialogue just yet. Um, don't feel anything so far for the characters. We're just beginning. So, uh, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you, I'll see you guys next time.